here. We've got over 50 ice sculptures already here at the park, and I'm here with Jeff Wolf. He is with Finesse. Uh, Finesse your ice. Finesse, Finesse ice. ice. Yes. And your team has created so many works of art, including this castle here, really beautiful. Yeah. But you're telling me now you're getting inspired by the warmer temperatures yeah, and inspired I, by spring. I normally like the winter. I even tell people I pray for cold, cloudy weather. However, <laughs> today it's going to be warmer and it's going to start getting nice. So what we're going to do in celebration of that, we're going to be carving a little rose here. Oh, and, very uh, cool. So that's the idea. Awesome. Okay, so uh, so you're going to do that now and kind of right tell now. us what you're doing. Yeah, Fantastic. This is really neat, and you've been doing this for a long time. This uh, for quite a while, yep. It's, um, so I'm going to carve a rose right through the center of this. Okay. And so it looks right about here. In the center there. So what I'm going to do is I'll take this die grinder right in here, spin this around. Now I'm going to start making the petals one at a time. This is so neat. This is a fun thing. Now, here's our little first flower. And from the other side, it should look pretty good. That's so cool. That is really neat just to watch that emerge in the center of the ice. I've never seen that. That's a really neat trick. And then you've actually kind of done some pre-prep on, on another flower. And with with... It is called the freeze vest, right? So we're still celebrating winter, but spring is right around the corner and we've got warmer weather on the way. This is just gorgeous. And tell me why you're shaving off the sides there. What I'm gonna do here is I just wanna catch this cause today's gonna be sunny. Today I will embrace the sun. <laughs> but with that, it's gonna show when you take a look at it from here, you'll see the rose here and here. So we'll basically get about 16 different images looking at this from different parts of the ice. Oh, that is so neat. You're so creative. And I know that you do a lot of the design and you do training and teaching others how to uh, yeah. continue this art. And this is beautiful. And then how do you make this stay so it doesn't get knocked off? Well, I could take, I'm going to take a little bit of water. And then that sort of helps it secure. So this is freeze it right back on. really incredible. Now, are you going to be here throughout the day? Oh my gosh, look how crystal clear that is. It gets it nice and clear and wow. what happens, this will now freeze right underneath it and that will, now it is frozen on, so it's there. That is so beautiful and Thank so you. crystal clear. And I love that people can come and walk around the park here throughout yeah. today, yeah. admire the art, and maybe you'll even get a glimpse of the uh, the man behind it all, the, the, sure <laughs> the artist. Jeff, you're going to be around today. I will. And uh, yeah, some of the uh, student competitors, there was a competition uh, yesterday. Different area community colleges uh, were there. Um, a gentleman named Mac Peskowski won it from Macomb Community College. He won oh, cool. his sculptures in there. So it's just a it's just a wonderful way to celebrate winter. And we like the cold, and uh, might as well get out and enjoy it. So and so people can come in today, sit in a nice bench and cool off a little bit while Absolutely. they sit down. So, so. And, and today, and really these ice sculptures will be here until the sun melts them, so Correct. you could have a, a little extra time even beyond today, but the event is 9 to 5. Come on down. It is the Freeze Fest, but looking ahead and celebrating the hope of spring. We, we love it. Thanks, Jeff. Thank Back you. to you. Take care.